welcome to the fourth leadership summit of i am raipur based on the theme new age new realities i am ayush agarwal from media and public relation committee of i am raipur today we are pleased to host mr abhishek de director and global head talent acquisition browser staff a very warm welcome sir thank you thank you for having me so the, my first question is since hybrid working environment has led to changes in the work environment how will it affect the employers and employees once we shift back to the old pattern i don't think any organization is really going to shift back to the old pattern at least in the tech space right it'll it'll either be hybrid or remote only for most part right um i think it's very important then for organizations to have those expectations clearly set and have those processes and systems clearly set which will help in that transition now from what it was earlier to the new reality so called and then going into the future and making it scalable and sustainable so uh, i again just to answer your question again i don't think we'll ever go back to a very very office based sort of work culture um completely awesome my second question is related to your sir recent uh, linkedin post uh, in one of your linkedin posts you recently uh, mentioned about the possibility of video resume what right. are your thoughts on its relevant relevance in today's job market um uh, well it started off as a gimmick when um, when someone did that for getting an interview at google and since then there have been obviously different templates right um like i'm sure you would have watched legally blonde and her video sop that goes into harvard for law school admission um it clearly is a way in which people can stand out from the clutter um there are advantages there are disadvantages uh, but then again given that now there are way more job seekers and the jobs are just what they were earlier it just helps in uh, catching the recruiter's eye but you obviously will have to follow it up with a really solid resume and an interview to get to get a job but it's more like a calling card to your resume in that sense do you think uh, that can be the new normal uh, given that we have shifted to online platforms i i don't think it's going to replace the regular resume but it definitely can augment it it can be a better form of a cover letter if you will yeah. so my third question is uh, on a general trend in terms of how can one person align their short term goals with their long term vision in the ever changing environment and how will it help the organization doing so sure so uh, again it depends on which organization they are in if someone's in a fast moving startup uh, the why the long term vision for the startup probably is 5 years horizon right whereas a more established company they are looking at a long term vision of maybe 10 years or 12 years right so when we are planning our careers as well i think one uh, motto that i completely live by is that career growth is not always vertical right you will have to take some of those horizontal moves to be able to reach where you want to get because it's also about tours of duty acquiring those experiences as you go along and then reaching where you want to reach because if you're just looking at linear growth you'll be a very one dimensional sort of straight jacketed uh, professional uh, which is why i would highly encourage people to look at uh, like horizontal moves into other f- sub functions within the larger function or maybe across functions as well if the opportunity so presents um and today a lot of organizations are allowing for that right um whereas you know traditional management training programs in say a unilever etc obviously allowed for that through the uh, business leadership training ship etc uh, but even startups or or tech firms today are allowing for people to move from marketing to sales hr to sales and so on and people should just grab some of those opportunities if they want to become a solid functional leader um, in the future like having some of those broader experiences definitely help rather than just growing in the realm of uh, one sub function so since you mentioned about being a solid uh, leader in future what advice would you like to give to students of iim lab who are going to be the future managers and leaders in terms of coping up with the new normal and setting a platform to be the leader um, of uh, of this changing environment 
Sure. So, uh, like for for any student, right? I think it's super important to make the most of this crisis as an opportunity, uh, because as the boundaries blur, like geographical boundaries also blur in terms of opportunities, right? So people would have access to more opportunities. There'll be huge democratization of opportunity. Um, I don't anticipate day zero, day one to be. that much of a big deal uh, going forward in the future either right so having said that then people have to really present their best foot forward uh, so couple of things that i've seen uh, and which is not specific to students of uh, i am raipur but one people need to know their resumes really well uh, whatever they are putting out there it's their calling card uh, it's your brand document right if you don't get that right uh, how will you pitch yourself right so that's that's one secondly they need to know the subject really well um the role that you are applying for right if it's hr you need to know what have you studied your favorite subjects in hr or in marketing right that becomes again very essential because at least as freshers the companies have nothing else to evaluate you on rather than adaptability or learning ability projects that you've done um summers uh, and the learning therein and so on right so those pieces have to be really spot on um and then finally uh, i think people to be ready for accepting different sort of challenges um and doing the research really thoroughly right because a lot of times people would want to just join a company because of the brand and stuff like that uh, but it's important then also to understand what's happening in that industry how that industry is trending so that you will be able to add some value in the conversation in the interview and obviously then the interviewer also feels that you are interested and truly interested and not just because oh uh, microsoft has come onto campus or whatever so yeah i really hope these ins- uh, insightful uh, valuable information are taken into consideration by students of iim raipur thank you sure. for uh, uh, sharing your valuable time with us sir uh, we will be pleased to have you, you on our beautiful campus in uh, near future Sure. Yeah, looking forward to that, and wish you guys all the best. I'm sure you'll do well. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Bye.